Hi guys, welcome back to Building a House in California. Today we wanted to create this video to talk to you guys a little bit about the electrical portion of this project and where we're at with it. So we, um, I believe in previous videos, uh, you've seen pictures of uh, the utility trenches we dug um, so that we could provide power to the property from uh, our electric utility, which is PG&E. Um, we have since then um, trenched over to the shop to that same location uh, so that the shop can be fed off of our main electric panel. And then uh, we've also set up our uh, backboard for the main electric panel and mounted um, that panel. So we've actually gotten pretty far with that stuff and uh, it's pretty exciting. And I'm sure Sarah will show you some pictures. Yeah. But We also, uh, yesterday, got the installation installed in the uh, floor of the house. And so before our contractor started sheeting the floor, I needed to get some electrical circuits stuffed up into our island in the kitchen. Uh, those need to go in before because there's no connection between the island and the ceiling. So I can't run them through the attic like I would the majority of the other circuits. So we stubbed um, a few different circuits into the island. Uh, one for the trash compactor we're gonna have there, uh, one for counter plugs, and then, um, we stepped one for uh, an electric stove, which we're not planning on putting an electric stove in now. Uh, we're actually planning on putting a gas stove in, but I wanted to set the electrical up in there just in case, uh, you know, in the future we decided to change that. <laughs> Cars driving by. <laughs> we don't live on a busy street. That was totally random. So the main electrical panel is in. Um, all of our trenches are dug and connected. So we now have a uh, conduit going from the main electric panel, one to the shop, one to the house, and we have our raceway for our wire to get uh, uh, power to both locations. Uh, and we actually also stubbed a extra conduit um, out to the shop, uh, which I plan on using eventually to put solar on the shop uh, so that I can run our solar circuit all the way back to the main panel and uh, connect it there. Thanks for watching. Tune back in and uh, wait for more videos. Subscribe on the button below and give us a thumbs up and a like if you like what we're doing. Thanks.